It's Friday. Time to go home. Relax. Boys playing in Athens tonight. Decide not to go. It's a good hour ride from here. Depends on how quick they uh, get their first game done. How quick my boy will play. And whether we make it in time or not, it's a big gamble. I mean, I love supporting my boy and my daughter at their games, but when it comes to traveling a distance, it's kind of tough. Get the visor down here. So another work week gone tomorrow morning, as long as it ain't pouring rain. Go out and chase some turkeys, be a spring gobbler. See if we can connect with one. I shoot a Mosberg 500. My boy is shooting a Mosberg 500, 12 gauge, only three inch shells. Pump action. Boy's never shot a bird, so trying to get him his first one. Try to remember to take camera with us in the morning. Maybe we'll get one on film. Farmer's Market. Probably going to be a mistake going down in town. They said it was busier than heck down here this morning, or this afternoon, however you want to call it. So the channel is slowly growing. I think the last I looked, we were at 211 subscribers. Need to get out some night and get some fishing videos in. Maybe this weekend. Trying to plan on it. Depending on how the rain falls. Checked the weather before I left. Said it's a feel like a 75 out today. Slight breeze. I don't feel as horrible. Daughter's gone on a field trip to Gettysburg. They're not due in until about 9.30 tonight. It's like a three to four hour ride from our house. Three hour, I'm going to say, closer. They left at eight this morning. I don't know why they didn't leave at like six. We ain't the officials of that. My boy never got to go because of COVID. Then he was supposed to go to New York City in sixth grade. Never got to go because terrorism was too high. So he's kind of got missed out on a lot of them trips. I would take him. I don't mind taking him down to Gettysburg, but. As far as going to the cities, no thanks. That's just not my forte. People love the city life. I care less for it. It's usually the busier end of town. All the fast food, everybody's stopping to get food on their travels. Of course, we got our Walmart. Now I can get some wind you know, through that traffic. Picked up a lot of bugs last night and this morning on my visor. Guess I'll have to clean that when we get home. I don't know if any of you on my channel 
Detroit DOT permits for wide loads or oversized road loads. Been taking all afternoon trying to write one half of the house. It's smaller than the first half of the house that I wrote. And they're telling me I can't get it through because of construction. Now, what sense does that make? I even started all over, deleted the permit, started all over with a new permit. And the house that's 14 foot 9 inches wide by 14 tall got through without an issue, no hiccups, but I go to write a 13 11 tall by 13 9 wide it won't let it through so explain that one same link smaller home and getting denied because of construction so how's the first one get through That's actually in New York State. New York State's a little more stricter on their DOT side. Even to escort, you gotta go there and take a 20 question test just to get your escort license. PA, anybody can escort as long as you know what you're doing. I always say PA is a little behind in times, but I don't know. Some of that red flag, red tape is a little much. We're getting his cars cleaned out. Covington Salvage. He's gonna be closing his doors as he's slowly selling everything out. Kind of curious to see how many people we see out scouting tonight. Went last night, birds weren't talking, but we did see them. So they're out there. Just a matter of getting them to talk. I don't use a turkey call to locate. Last night we didn't use any kind of call. Normally sometimes we'll hit the hooter. Get an owl hoot. But we just stayed there quietly. 8.20. Bird was crossing the road. I was kind of shocked to see him on the ground still. But hey, each is room. That reminds me, I gotta mow grass when I get home. Fun, fun. Get the fire up the new Honda that I bought. Self propelled from Home Depot. Hopefully it's better than the Toro I bought from Lowe's. Two times more in my yard that went back. Things smoked. You didn't have to worry about skeeters or anything. Smoked so bad. It was a guaranteed start. You could pull it 50 times and never get it started. Do not recommend the Toro 163cc 22 inch blade. Self propelled. You wouldn't think taking that windshield off makes much difference, but what a difference. I can't wait to get it back at this point. A lot of upper chest around your neck wind you don't normally have. Like keep her down on a lower setting. I had risers on it. I like the risers. I like the wind protection, put the visor on my helmet, running a dual sport, all terrain, whatever you want to call them. Uh, you would get vibration after 55, you, you're almost felt like a bobblehead going down the road. So I took the risers back off, went back to the stock height windshield. Maybe I get my GPS put on, I'll change it. I don't know, we'll have to wait and see. New helmets we're getting don't have the sun visor on them, or whatever whatever kind of visor you wanna call them. But they do have the sun shades inside, 
still a modular style helmet, dual sport style. So, just waiting to see as to if it. Hopefully, they're a little quieter. This one, you're going down the road. I think it's the visor where it screws on. You hear a little bit of noise. I always think it's the bike. I don't really think it's the bike. I think it's more than the helmet because they're when well, I. I don't know, it's kind of hard to tell what, when you ride without a helmet. You don't hear it. But then again, you got twice the wind on your ears, so it makes it tough. I'm going to hold and check the oil in the mower and get it out. Might as well start mowing, get that process over. It only takes about 20 minutes. So the yard's a little higher than it should be. It might take a little bit more, might have to mow the front yard twice. One on a lower setting or a higher setting, then go to the lower setting. Time will tell. We'll see if this mower is any better. It's a shame. All your newer stuff's getting worse and worse. Less quality. They say more horsepower and it's less. I don't know. A lot of things are messed up anymore. I think I'll go put some shorts on. And a shirt. Girl just ran into that tree when she was walking away from her mom's vehicle. Walked right into it sideways.